Hi everyone, my name is Jackie and I love magic and welcome back to a new video on my channel. I've always wondered who could be my boyfriend if I went to Hogwarts and I always wished it would be Harry or Ron because I'm just obsessed with them. I think they're so cute. I also like Bill Weasley very much so that will be cool but I'd like to start off with saying thank you so much for the support on my uh, first video on this channel it, it has been amazing so many comments so many likes so many people subscribed so thank you so much for that I did not expect that it would go so well for, my, for the first video that's like yeah a dream come true so keep it coming it makes me so happy and excited to post more videos next week hopefully a DIY I'm not promising anything but hopefully a DIY and at the end of August there might be a cake baking video and I'm so excited Ta! today I would like to find out who would be my boyfriend if I went to Hogwarts and I have got some quizzes here on the internet for you and we are going to find out who would be my boyfriend which Harry Potter character will be your boyfriend? Does Draco fancy you? Or maybe Harry? Please not Draco. I don't like blonde guys and he is also even a bad guy. Well, he's not really a bad guy, but too weak for me if you ask me. Which house? Gryffindor, Hufflepuff, Slytherin or Ravenclaw? Well, I'm in Gryffindor, so... I'm gonna choose my own house, man. Will you be playing Quidditch or watching it? For sure playing it. I would love to play that. It would be so cool to fly on a broomstick. No Quidditch playing for me. I'll be watching. Definitely playing. I might play, but I'm not very good. Definitely playing. That's not even a question. <laughs> well, it was a question, but not for me. What's your favorite subject? Her, bi her biology, potions, none other, defense against the dark arts. <sighs> oh my god, this is so difficult. I do like her biology, I just can't pronounce it because I'm Dutch. It's very difficult for me some words. I do like potions and I like defense against the dark arts. Oh no, but I think maybe I'm too scared for the dark arts. I think I'm going for potions because if you know a lot of things about potions, you can like defeat the dark arts and yeah choose your favorite harry potter quote the ones that truly love us never really leave us it takes a great deal of courage to stand up to your enemies but a great deal more to stand up to your friends fear of a name increases fear of the thing itself i solemnly swear that i'm up to no good happiness can be found even in the darkest times if only one if one only remembers to turn on the light. I think I'm gonna go for this one because that's the one that really sticks in my head when I watch the movies. Oh, that's my run, my runny. Oh my God, that's so embarrassing. Okay. Who would be your Hogwarts bestie? Cho Chang, hell no girl. Pansy Parkinson, no idea who that is. Luna Lovegood, Hermione Granger, Ginny Weasley. Ginny Weasley, no girl, like no. I like her, but I just don't like how they, how she got together with my man, Harry, out of nowhere. Like, well, it's not out of nowhere, but Cho Chang and her and, and Ginny, no. Luna, I like her, but she's too like hippie for me. So I think I'm gonna go for Hermione because she's like really daring. Yeah, I, I'm gonna go for Hermione. Do you prefer bad boys or good boys? Or I don't know. <laughs> oh gosh, I don't know. Okay, I said I don't know, so I should choose I don't know. Pick a professor. Dumbledore, Snape, Hagrid, Sprout, Other. Hmm. I like Hagrid. I like Dumbledore. What if I click Other? I don't think there's gonna be like more options, right? I think... Dumbledore because he's very smart. Are you prideful? Sort of. I don't know. Um, no, not really. Yes, I'm the best. No, I'm not the best. So no. Choose a wrong gif. I think this one. He looks very cute in that one. Which is your pet? Owl, cat, toad, rat. Owl. Oh yes, Cedric. I love Cedric. Which is your favorite? Cedric, Ron, Harry, Draco, Fred or George, Neville, Longbottom, Crabble, Grabble. I think I'm gonna go for Ron. Oh god, calculating. Please. Oh my god, I'm so nervous. Hey! <laughs> yes, queen! 
Your Hogwarts boyfriend is Harry Potter. He's loyal, brave, kind, and pretty much saves the whole world. He's a total package and you totally deserve him. I feel like we should do one more. So I have another one here. It's from BuzzFeed. I think it's gonna be good. Let's just try it, test it out, see what, what's the outcome and who's gonna be my boyfriend in this test. What house are you in? Gryffindor! Would you rather your boyfriend always said they were better than you? Hell no. Always take you on adventure and nearly get you killed. Fancied another girl. Always made you do what he wanted to. Always broke things or blew things up. Always left you to go out with their with their best friend. Always played tricks on you. Always goes out with his friends and leaves you on your own. Steals your food. Tells you how clever they are and makes you out. What the hell? This is so mean. Okay, let's steal my food then because that's just really rude. Would you want your boyfriend to agree with you and talk about people behind their backs together? Always make sure you were having fun. Did anything for you. Made sure that you would always do things together. Made sure you would always feel safe. Always told you how good you are. Play straight on people with you. Always on life. Helped you learn things. Made sure that no one ever was always loyal. I think loyal. I think loyalty is something very important in a relationship. So yes, I would like him to be loyal. He's taking you out for the day. Where would you want to go? Anywhere. He's rich. He could pay for anything. No, I'm not, I'm not like that at all. I don't like when people pay for me on a date or whatsoever i just hate it because i feel i make my own money so i should pay for my own if he's rich he power up probably deserves it so going on an adventure trying to find a murderer who has just escaped from Azkaban to a Quidditch match for a visit to a massive garden center to ireland to see his family to a football match to a joke shop for a nice meal out he doesn't care he's not playing nowhere he's staying at school not a nice meal out because i don't like to go out on a date and eat together because no i just hate the sounds of people eating Ugh, it makes me cringe so much to a joke shop football match football no joke shop is fun family that's cool i'd like to go to ireland to see his family I think that's nice, right? Yeah. You've gone out for a meal together. He's paying. He says you can have anything you want. What do you choose? The biggest, most expensive slice of chocolate cake there is. A big expensive roast. A little bit of everything. You feel bad to make him spend his money. So just a glass of tap water. The cheapest meal. You're not going out. You're staying at home. Having a nice homemade meal of his. Whatever he's having. Everything. That's a bit of me. <laughs> Some fish is brain food. Nothing, you don't trust him to buy a food, he might do something to it. What? Okay, I think I would like choose the cheapest meal there is so that I don't feel too bad. Because I think it's not nice to like refuse when something wants to pay for you. So yeah, that one is it. He keeps on hanging around with a horrible group of people. You keep on trying to persuade him to make friends with someone you trust. So I have to choose somebody that I trust. Draco, Harry, Ron, Neville, George, Seamus, Dean, Cedric. So I can choose Ron or Harry again, but I want to choose someone else. I think I'm going to go for George this time. The only class you're both in is the one you both both choose. It is Archie's Mancy. I can't pronounce my English words. Muggle studies, divination, study of an ancient runes, care of magical creatures. Oh, <gasps> yes, I don't even need to read that one. Care of magical creatures, I'm all over that. How would people describe you in one world? Cunning, loving, cunning, do I say that right? I hope I said it right, otherwise it's very embarrassing. Loving, loyal, kind, enthusiastic, caring, funny, pretty, creative, clever. I know a lot of people say that I'm creative. Because I make, I like to make a lot of stuff. And if I make something, people are always like, Oh my god, you're so creative, and blah, blah, blah. It's stupid that I can only choose one. Because I would do loving and loyal and kind. And choose, I would almost choose all of them. And finally, what would people say is the worst thing about you? Oh god, no. What a great way to end this quiz or test. You don't think before you do things. You are self-centered. You're not very fair. Very fair. Very fair. <laughs> you don't remember anything. You're aggressive. You don't think for yourself. You don't know when 
You've taken a joke too far, you're a little competitive, you try and copy your friends, you turn on the people you love the best. No, no. The other one's no. I think I'm gonna choose that one. What? Gregory Goyle? Goy Did it even say that correct? What? Hell no. I don't like this test. Let's stay with Harry, okay? <laughs> I just won't put this in the video. <laughs> no. Well, maybe he's a nice person. I don't know. If the test said that he's a nice person, he's the one for me. Let's have a date. Let's go to Hogwarts, have a date. Let's have a speed date with Harry, Ron and Gregory. <laughs> well guys and girls, if you enjoyed this video, please give this video a thumbs up, subscribe for sure. Next week, hopefully a DIY. I'll try my best, really. I'm gonna try my best. In the end of August, a baking video and I'm so excited for that. If you have any video suggestions, please leave them below. Do you like these things? Do you like kind of quizzes or do you want to see things? Just let me know in the comments below. That's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. I love you very much and I will see you next week. Bye!